zap 9 this is our controlling area we've already set that okay Okay, basic settings. Uh, 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 profit center accounting yeah basic settings uh, controlling area settings maintain controlling area settings zap 920 legal valuation activate indicator all done okay next is Master data, profit center, create dummy profit center. Why do we create dummy? I'll just tell you that. Okay, dummy, zap nine underscore dummy, basic data, already been assigned as a see your zap nine. It's already, okay, it's already assigned. We have already made it. Zap, zap dummy. Okay, we've already created this, which is okay, which is good. Okay. Hmm. We've already created this. Now, why do we actually require this gym? Okay, no segment and profit center. Save as inactive. Okay, and activate. Okay. This is created. Now, why do we create dummy? Because? Dummy. Let me share. Okay. Cost centers. That collect expenses or costs from finance, the, that which have to be transferred to production cost centers. These cost centers report to dummy profit centers. Why? Because these cost centers have no other role but to transfer to I value to production cost center. Now, production cost centers can have profit centers. Okay. That is the reason. Okay. <clears throat> profit centers. Okay. Uh, there are cost centers that capture costs from finance, from general entries, and then transfer these to production cost centers. Now, production cost centers don't get direct no. uh, entries. No. These, these entries are transferred from these cost centers. So these cost centers must report to a profit center because every cost center is represented by a profit center or supervised. So these cost centers have no other role but to transfer cost. So that's why dummy profit centers are created as a placeholder, okay? Okay, basic settings, activate direct postings, set control parameters for actual data. 
okay 2024 line items and it will be real time line items okay so when we'll create controlling so uh actual actual data which is costs transfers general entries like expenses will be transferred from fi or from any other module to co on real time okay and line items will be reported not summarized okay this is basically the crux of it okay um, plan versions plan versions maintain plan versions okay plan version controlling area settings zero settings for each fiscal year for zap 9 integrated planning copying is allowed uh general version definition zero profit center settings line items exchange rate m plan actual version okay all set <laughs> okay now next step is next step is master data profit centers define profit center okay create profit center x is 101 master data x01 is already existing okay x02 this is also existing okay. 103 okay 103 is paint shop paint shop Socket center group. Okay, zap. Okay, uh, zap nine and segment. No segment. Save as inactive. Activate. We have three profit centers. Yeah, okay. Yeah. 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 Okay, profit center is done. Next step is GL accounts, we will be creating GL accounts now. Okay, so that we can pass on entries. Zap 9, uh, 400, 500 is already done. Okay. <clears throat> 400, 500, cost element category. cost element category which is primary cost and this will be used for uh, used in controlling on so okay now 
Next step is OBC4. This is for field status variant. ZAP9, field status groups. G02, cost accounts, where cost centers will be. Additional cost center will be required. Okay, this is good. It is already created. FS00. Retained earnings is also created and control data. Create bank interest G01 post automatically. No post automatically are, are for those accounts that will only calculate and permute it because a retained earnings account collect expenses and income for the whole year and club it. And the rest, the balance, either profit or loss, is then adjusted against uh, the capital equity account. Okay. Cash account is also, also already made. Okay. Now, what we want is... Next step. Next step is controlling cost center accounting, master data, cost center, individual processing, KS01, create, okay. X1001, valid from Cost center controlling area, master data. 2024-01. Cost center already exists. Change. Enter. Zap 9. X1001. Okay, fair enough. X102. Two one zero one. Okay, it's already made. Two thousand one master data X one zero and one. Okay, fair enough. <clears throat> SPRO controlling profit center accounting assignments of accounting objects check assignments cost centers Disclosure for profit center, profit center group with the disclosure without consent, disclosure without profit centers. Execute ZAP 9, execute. Okay. 103, 101, 201, 101 is only 103 is without a profit center. Okay. So that is good. Next step. Cost center. 
cost center. No, we'll have to go for. Cost center group, KSH1. Fraud. Change the object. Okay, we have X01, 102201. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Okay, now next is cost element. But before cost element, we have to make cost element group kh1 admin okay admin cost element group zap 9 cost element okay Four hundred five nine one. Save. Personal. Cost element. Four hundred, five hundred. Salary. Save. Okay. FB zero one L. Now let's try entries. Zap nine. Document date is two thousand twenty four zero one zero one. Posting date is today's date. Okay. Four hundred, five hundred. Control indicators don't exist. Okay, no controlling uh, for controlling area. Control indicators, control indicators. Two thousand twenty four, two thousand twenty four. Period twelve. Oh no. Zero one. <laughs> Financial accounting. Fiscal year. <laughs> Sign company code to fiscal year variant. Zap nine V three April to March. Okay, A four. A four save. Zap nine. Posting period is V three. No, we we will keep it simple from January December. Yeah, that is the issue. FB zero one L. Zero one zero one. Posting period is not open. 
Spion, oh. Global settings, ledgers, posting periods, posting periods, open and close posting periods, Zap 9. Oh, it doesn't exist. Assign variants, Zap 9. And nine FS. Okay. L nine FS from account. That's the thing. Twenty four. Twenty three. Save. Save at B01L four hundred five hundred number range is missing. Share. Copy to company code. Okay. Fiscal year 2024, double eight fold two. Zap nine. Execute. Interval is added. Okay, twenty seven thousand and uh, X one one zero one and uh, salaries payment forty four hundred six hundred. Okay, eighteen thousand. One zero zero one events fifty two hundred six nine one Zap nine one zero does not exist on ten three. Why doesn't it exist on ten three? Shock ASH two. No. KS02. 1001. 24 1. 1001. Body shop. X001. Lap 9. Everything is good. Control. Lock. No lock. Got quantity. Save. FB01L. Four hundred five hundred. X zero zero one. Four hundred, six hundred, eighteen thousand, little bit, fifty, 
Expenses, payments, display document overview, post category is not assigned. Okay, SM30. Maintain. Uh, Zap9 inactive. Save. Okay. Post Universal Ledgers. Customize signature for Universal Journal. Okay. Customize check the customer use transaction. Okay, this is the error. We'll go to this transaction. Currency type 30 are missing. Currency conversion setting, no valuation profile assigned. Okay, we'll do this in next class. Okay.